If this is a look into our future, it's not too pretty, but at least it's clean. What you're looking at is Honda's hydrogen fuel cell powered vehicle called the FCX. As part of their continuing research into advanced transportation technologies, Honda has actually brought this little car to market in limited quantities, and for those who get to drive it, it's a very unique experience. In a way, it almost seems strange to call the FCX a car, it's more like a transportation appliance. Starting the car is a near silent process and involves a short boot up procedure. After a few moments of high tech whizzing sounds, a message comes across the display alerting the driver that the car is ready to be driven. Stepping on the gas, uh, I mean hydrogen pedal, results in better than expected acceleration, especially from a goofy looking car like this. But what is really interesting is the sound the FCX makes when accelerating. It sounds like you're sitting on the inside of a jet plane. As the FCX speeds up, the whirring sound continues to intensify, but unlike a traditional car, there's no gear change to lower the pitch, so the whine continues to escalate. Don't misunderstand, the system is actually pretty quiet, but as one colleague put it, it sounds like it's from a movie about the future. The digital gauges also look like they're from a science fiction film. As the FCX rolls around town, the display shows a variety of information including speed, miles remaining in the tank, and a watts meter measures the electricity the FCX is using versus the watts it's creating with regenerative technologies. If you're confused about just how hydrogen is related to electricity, don't worry, you're not alone. But basically, a tank full of compressed hydrogen is piped into a fuel cell stack where the hydrogen reacts with a platinum electrode, which in turn produces DC electrical current. This current is fed into an electrical motor, which then turns the wheels. You can think of it as an electric car, but instead of a charged battery pack supplying energy to the motor, the fuel stack creates electricity on the fly. Overall, it's an extremely clean system, the only exhaust product being pure water, which flows from the tailpipe when the car is powered off. But despite all the G-Wiz technology, when it comes down to it, it actually drives like a normal car. The biggest hurdle for Honda to overcome, however, is the driving range of the FCX. The current system is limited to just 120 miles, which is great for a commute, but not real convenient for longer trips. Honda is making progress here, though, with a new system that promises to deliver 210 miles between refuelings. And speaking of refueling, the process is a bit different from a normal car. Before filling up, the car needs to be electrically grounded, and the hydrogen pump connection requires an airtight seal. Not too complicated, but it will take some practice to get used to. For years now, pundits have proclaimed that hydrogen will be the long-term solution to our transportation challenges, and although we're still a long way away from a hydrogen highway, as a proof of concept, the FCX is a convincing piece of evidence that hydrogen fuel cells will indeed play a major role in the future of transportation.